Good morning, good morning, good morning. How are we doing? Update 9, update 9 is here. Yes, yes, yes. Look at our skill points. They've been reset. We have seven expertise points. Of course, we have our knowledge that we've been working towards. Yeah. Let's take a look. Here is our new abilities. So we got Nova, Vein Miner, Rampage. We have Ghost Walk and Spirit Walk. The Dash. With the Dash Warp. That one looks pretty fun. Mega Jump. The Shell. When active, you will give you hardened skin. To stun mobs. Cool. So, Porcupine Shell. Rejuvenation. Of course, heal. The new empower. Javelins. Yeah, buddy. So I have to go in here. We're going to have to reset everything. Here's our new talents. Good deal. And of course our knowledge stuff has not changed much at all. So I think we're still working towards Kajirium. I think that's a smart move. Alright, but we do have a quest book. Welcome to Vault Hunters 3rd Edition. This mod pack turns your experience into action RPG game. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The quest line will teach you about the basic fundamentals. Yeah, so I know a lot of people are restarting before you start playing. Mm -hmm. Difficulty mode that suits you. Yep, yep. Awesome. I am. You have completed a quest. Acquire 16 raw chromatic iron. Okay. So I can do that.
Ooh, do we want to take a skill? Uh... We could have took fortune there and got more out of it, but... Chromatic iron. The first step starting. Yep. Complete. Awesome. Bam. Let's see. Volt stone. Mine 16 volt stone. Okay. So we got some chip vault rock. Claim that. So yep, we need those to craft our vault rocks. Four of those, one chromatic. Yep, yep. So we need to craft the vault rock. So that, hey, 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 flatty, flatty. <clears throat> okay, so that is done. We put those two in there. Put the vault stone in there. Sounds good. I will check. I will check. I will check. Let's see. Strange YouTube TV. What's going on? Let's see. Loading, loading, loading. <clears throat> uh, yeah, it looks like um, Streamlabs is... Greg, how are you? What? A vault hunter. <laughs> Say this is a vault hunter. Me. I are vault hunter. Let's see if that worked with JEI. Um, a little bit. Uh, vault Hunters is a mod put out by Iskall85 and his development team. Uh, if you're familiar with Hermitcraft, he is a hermit. Um, and yeah, 
Yeah, so it is an action RPG game. We're actually, uh, go, this is update 9. We're actually going right back through um, the uh, brand new quest line that was introduced here in update 9. The game is still in, uh, is still in beta. Um, kind of, update 9 kind of wrapped up the uh, open alpha stage and so now they have moved on to the beta stage so it's, it hasn't even fully been released yet uh, but yeah that's what uh, that's what it is we're kind of going through this is a brand new thing that was introduced uh, yesterday in the update for update 9 um, kind of introduces what vault hunters is so um, you make uh, different types of vault crystals and such and then you run into vaults kind of like uh, Diablo uh, get loot um, escape with your life and um, and yeah so like our completely uh, our s skill system has been reset um, so we're looking uh, we're we got to pick these we got 35 different I don't want to punch a tree in Minecraft here you want me to punch a tree I'll go punch a tree I'm also working with uh, a new, the new HUD system here, so you can see that we got percentages on our magnet and our armor, which is brand new. It's a brand new uh, resource pack that was added to the mod. Um, let's see, yeah, see that drags it all the way in. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see. <laughs> but yeah, Vault Hunters is pretty fun. It's just a, uh, it's a great little uh, Minecraft game. Mod, it's um, really, really nice. Mini map times four. Huh. All right. Punch a tree, you say? Okay, fine. There we go. Punch a tree. So yeah, we got some skill points, expertise points to spend. And this is our vault um, portal. So we're gonna make up a crystal here in a minute. Well, yeah, we're just kind of looking at some of, some of the features here of Update 9. So we got to acquire a Vault Altar, and I think I can just do this. Well, there we go. And it completes it for us. So, boom. Boom. Oh, I got auto jump on, too. Yeah, it re completely reset everything. Uh, let's see. So, da, 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 da. I just noticed I'd auto jump. Um, goodbye. And then we'll work on our keybinds here in a minute. But yeah, it completely reset everything. Cool. Alright. Uh, let's see. Quest log. Alright, so we completed that. We get a button. So the button was to do that but since I already had a button on mine we'll just throw the button in the system let's see vault crystals it's time to forge a vault crystal for the first time uh, every recipe is different so using your vault rock that you acquired on the altar uh, so you can do different things blah 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 and it gives us a shulker box which is very important for uh, beginning players because you can go into a vault and you have more inventory space. Let's see. So this one says we need glowstone, salmon, stone, and sugarcane. All right. And of course, the recipes, um, when you start out, it'll be a lot smaller. It'll be like one, two, maybe three, you know. Uh, but since I've, I've played a little bit, we've already, we're already up to level 35. Our recipes are a little bit bigger let's see some stone you say all right 
so we got some stone. Do we have any salmon in our system? Raw salmon. We have 17. Which is not enough. <laughs> I'll just go get three salmon. So let's do that. Let's go get three salmon real quick. <clears throat> With our bamboo stick, we need to do some harvesting here. Now last night there was salmon like right here. So, of course now today there won't be. I'll have to go to the river. Say so I'll have to go to the river. So, sugarcane and glow stuff. Glow. Bam. All right, we just need our salmon. And we'll be good to go to get, do more with our quest line. But yeah, if uh, if you have not played Vault Hunters yet, um, or if you are just starting, I would encourage you to restart. Go to Curse Forge, download the mod pack. It's completely free. Man, we're so slow because I haven't taken speed yet. Um, and yeah, just uh, have fun with it. Uh, have fun with it. But yeah, if you're if you're an old school Diablo fan, um, you like running in um, like vaults, like and stuff, um, caves, like World of Warcraft, um, stuff like that. There's new mobs Betw between the different uh, terrain and mobs. I think there's like 30 new different uh, biomes for the vaults and mobs as well. So they've done a big overhaul. Hello. Thank you. There's my three. So we do need to do our skill points before we run into a vault. We need to, because I don't even have dash right now. Say, so how are we supposed to move? So yeah, I'll probably take speed. Um, might take haste. I don't know if we'll go fully in speed, because that's, I think, 16. So we might do... Might do two points. Take eight of our points, or skill points, in uh, in speed, just so we can move around faster. We'll take some in dash. Probably one, at least one in vein miner. Yeah, we're moving so slow. It's it's weird. It's so weird <laughs> when it resets. Okay, um, so let's finish this. So bam, and then we hit the button. Look at the animation, so cool. Bam, we have acquired our crystal, which means we can complete this. This gives us a shulker box uh, for our completion. Yes, there it is. We'll throw that in the system. All right, so let's eat a carrot. All right, so skills and talents. So before you get into your vault, we want to inform you about a few important parts of Vault Hunters. You have in-depth abilities and talent systems. Yep, yep. More enjoyable. Let's see, focus on powerful active skills. Yep, yep. Nova, Rampage, Healing. 
Um, so Talents Fire player with massive buffs. Uh, UAI, okay. All right, your reward for this quest is one skill point. So it's highly recommended if you take the heal ability if this is your first time playing. Um, so yeah, so if you're a first time player, take the heal ability. I will show it to you here momentarily. So we're gonna complete that. We got ourselves a skill point. Um, so yeah. Okay, fine. You know what? Destroy the tree. You really want me to destroy the tree? Fine, fine, Minecraft. I will destroy the tree. Do I like to update? There we go. So yeah, so we had 35 skill points. Now we have 36, so that gave us our skill point. Uh, and I know it's going to pop up with create some planks next. I need to figure out how to turn that thing off. <coughs> You gotta do it's something in the code I know. You gotta do it. All right, so we got better enchanting. All right, so let's take a look here at our skill system. All right, um, so we have thirty six to play with. Thirty six up here. All right, so speed costs four. So if we take two in speed, that'll give us a speed two. Um, so that's eight of our points, leaving us 28 left. All right, so we do we do have to manage our, our skill points because there is a limit now. It's, it's, it used to be unlimited skill points. Now it is 101. You can get 101 total skill points in the game. Um, so you, you used to be able to unlock like all your skills and talents. Now it's a pick and choose your type of build. So, we're going to work on our keybinds and stuff like that. Um, heal. Yep. There you go. we got to work on our keybinds, like I said. But uh, it heals you for two, which is one heart. Um, cool down, ten seconds. I think starting off, we're going to go simple. We're going to go simple. We're going to take our speed. We'll probably take haste. We'll probably take level two haste. We probably won't do three yet. We'll do level two. So that's four, eight, nine, ten. So that's ten. Um, we'll probably do at least two and heal so 12 we're gonna d d unlock javelins so that'll be two so that's 14 and so then we'll take a couple in our enhancement enhancements here javelin enhancements Probably do the interesting increased damage one. Let's conduit. Gives you conducting power, making it able to transfer any on hit effect except lucky hit to the throne. So on hit effects include clouds, stunning, and shocking. Okay. Cool, cool. Hey, thanks for following. Dio Trent, appreciate you, appreciate you. Thank you, Streamlabs. It did work, Flatty, if you were wondering. It did just work there. I heard the beep. Um, so, yeah, it did work. So, thank you, Dio Trent. I hope that's how you pronounce your name, Dio Trent. All right, so we also got to figure out what's uh, expertise. Of course, we have Angel. <laughs> create a flight anybody might come in handy later uh, we'll probably at least take one in fortunate so we get fortune four um, so we need at least one there so we got seven yes okay here see look planks you're happy thank you thank you minecraft uh, let's see what do we got what is this one 
Ah, uh, gather elixir. Okay, so we gotta gather some elixir. Um, <clears throat> alright, let's take, let's continue looking here. Better enchanting. Yes, the vault enchanter. Acquire a vault inch. Oh, guys, right here. This is the biggest game changer in Minecraft. Vault enchanter. All right. Do we have everything? No. We need chromatic. So one, two. Boom, boom, boom. Biggest game changer in Minecraft right here, guys. Huh. Thank you, Iskal and his team. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That's all we're going to say about that. I don't care who you are. Boom. And then, here, let's just throw this right there. Hey, you know what? You know what I need on my helmet? I need respiration on my helmet, guys. I do. I, I, just, I need respiration on my helmet. Oh, look at there. For five emeralds. Respiration three. Bam. Done. Thank you. Thank you, helmet. Thank you, enchanter. I appreciate you. Yes. Yes, we appreciate you. All right. There, we're done. Anything you want. So if I want to replace fortune with <clears throat> silk touch, I can do that right now. I just have to have five emeralds. Boom, and one experience level, I have that. Boom, everything, all right here in your enchanter. No longer do you have to trade with villagers. Do any of that hot mess. Hey, water, cool. There we go, better enchanting completed. Here's something brand new as well that we did not have in any of the previous updates. Health potions, so these are vault potions. They only work inside the vaults um, and they help you heal because you don't heal naturally in the vault. So that's why it encourages you to take like the heal skill and stuff like that. So. We want to make a heal potion. So craft a vial, all right? And the first one is, I think it's pretty cheap. I think it's like a poppy. <laughs> Boom. A vial. Um, yeah, it's a poppy. Uh, of course, you can create any of the, I can create any of these at this point. Um, if I want to. I have to unlock potions for my research. Got to unlock brews for that. But yeah, so this one is the beginner one. Um, it recharges a um, slot every five minutes, and that includes inside the vault. So you get 25 minutes in a vault, so you can recharge it five times if you go all the way down to zero seconds. And it heals you for two hearts, two Minecraft hearts. So four hit points. And of course you have better ones. So that has four, or uh, that heals you for four. You know, the next one that for heals you for six, heals you for 10, and so forth. Of, this one is also the beginner one right here, but this one recharges on uh, killed mobs. So if you kill 150 mobs, it will recharge a slot. So you can either do this one to start off with, or this one, I think. So we're going to do this one. So we'll just have this as a nice little backup um, to heal us if we need a heal inside the vault. Soul shards. All right, unaliving mobs grants you soul shards, which was there was a big buff to soul shards in this. So we needed to craft a soul shard pouch okay and then you use the shards to purchase stuff in the black market which is over here so it takes soul shards oh and this was updated too 
It resets after every two hours now, which is kind of cool. All right. Um, soul shard pouch. I think we need purple wool exactly, right? Shard pouch. Yeah, you need purple wool. Specific. It's very specific. Um, okay. So, we need some wool. Uh, I don't have purple, but I do have... So, let's find some purple dye. Hello, bees. Let's see. If I do, what? Blue and red, that makes purple, right? So, um, purple, purple gelatin, just double checking, uh, blah, 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 let's see, blue, we have some blue dye, All right, and then we need some red dye. I can get that from the tulip. Cool. So if we do that, we do that. We have two purple. Right? Oh no, it's not like that. Okay. Say it's not like that. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. So purple dye. I thought it was kind of cool with wool that you could do your own your own stuff. Purple wool. Let's see. You can dye any color wool. Oh, so it only does one. All right, that's fine. So let's see. Let's go red tulip then. So we'll need two more of these. Do that, do that, boom. Make some purple wool. Soul shard pouch. Boom. Acquired, yes. All right, we have acquired our pouch, and we get 32 soul shards for that. Boom, and it should go right into our pouch. Yep, went right into our pouch. Isn't that pretty cool? That's pretty cool. We hadn't actually created one of these yet, so it's not bad. We will definitely use it. All right, what else we got? Vault hunting. Build yourself a vault portal. Okay, we got that. With an assortment of vault stone, okay, blocks similar to nether portals. Yep, yep. Um, we have a vault time to complete before it goes to zero. So, yep, if you die, you return to the overworld. Uh, beginner's grace up to level 20. So that's important, so you don't lose anything. And enter a vault for 32 bronze. Enter a vault. Cool. So, uh, let's, 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 let's do skills, and then we'll enter a vault. Um, all right, so let's go expertise first. This is, no, let's go, let's go talents first. <laughs> all right, we know we're going to take two in speed. We're going to do that. We'll do two in haste. Uh, we're gonna definitely go javelins, so that's two there, and then I can think I can go two more, which cooldown is every two seconds, and that knocks them back to three. It doesn't increase mana cost at all. Um, yeah, we'll do that, and we can always respect these. We have orbs of regret. Um. Let's take at least two and heal. 
Uh, we're gonna do learn vein miner. So we don't have fortunate on vein miner anymore, because uh, that is now an expertise. So if we want to do fortunate, it's automatic. We just add it to it. All right, so we have 19 left. Uh, so I think we should spec into this. Do we have anything on our on hit effects? Let's take a look. We have chaining, sweeping, okay. So those are our two on hit effects. Uh, which also does increase damage, okay. So, nothing, nothing, we don't have any shocking or anything. Um, so let's see, we might want to increase our damage by, let's say, I don't know, two, so plus 20%. Um, increase those by two, why not? Okay. Um, probably wouldn't be a bad idea to take one in strength. Uh, we'll definitely take one in hunter. Let's see, 120 seconds, that is two minutes. If I scan, yep, yeah, okay. I'm not that quick in the vaults, so it would take me two minutes to do anything anyway. All right, so we gotta do a keybind for Javelin, and I think I wanna go with Nova. Just regular Nova. We're gonna do this, so that gives us 80% of our output damage. We can cast it every 20 seconds for 30 mana, okay. All right, so we don't have any lucky on hit effects yet. Um, okay. Okay, Flatty. Have a good rest of your day, sir. Enjoy, enjoy. So we could take one of the masteries here. So we got 13. Um, let's see. We can mine currently eight blocks. Um, take another Nova. Let's see, we could do a totem, a rejuvenation totem. Heals all players in a range. That's interesting. Oh, we definitely want to go dash. on dash I need to heal quite a bit uh, what else we need uh, let's take a strength and we could always we can always respect we can always respect if we need to if we find something that we we don't like Blizzard, Frostbite, Toxic Reaction, Blight. Leech. Yeah, we probably definitely need to build like a Lucky Hit type build as well. Oh yeah, that's right, we need to look at, well,
we need to look at building a new um, a new sword as well. Because I think he was, because uh, that'll give us the lucky hit. Because we can't get it on the old stuff. I'm pretty sure. <coughs> Might not be able to get it on some of the old stuff. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Let's see. Everything is enchanted with what it needs. Okay. All right, let's try. I think the old ones are broke because I read they redid. Um, they redid stuff. I think for swords for their damage output. Um. And I believe he was saying do something with like making a new sword. So, uh, well, we could try this. I mean, it's within the range that is current, I think. So it's not too bad. Um, our shield is looking very poor. However, uh, ba -ba 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 -ba, see repair core. Of course, shields also. Got a little bit of a buff as well, I believe. But uh, we'll go ahead and repair ours real quick. I do want to get into a vault. I do want to get into a vault. Okay. Okay, let's see, we do have our expertise that we need to decide on. Uh, we're definitely going to take one in Fortunate. Um, this actually is really, you could have two active bounties. So reduce the bounty wait time to 30 minutes. Yep. Definitely take one in that right now. Bartering. Um, shopping pedestals inside. I'm not too worried about that. Unbreakable. Not losing dirt, but 6% chance. It's kind of low, it seems like. I said he was going to drop these, but it looks like he didn't. The percentage chance. <coughs> Um, yep, Trinketeer, Divine, gain base affinities, experience, might not be a bad one to take, Artisan, gain a chance to not consume crafting potential when rerolling, okay, so we still have five, Fortune five? On a tool, I mean, that's not bad. Um, and then we gain one, we gain an experience point every five levels. So we're, we will get, we'll grab another one at level 40. Um, Having two active bounties at any given time is pretty awesome. Yep, I'm doing it. 
Uh, let's see, we got three left. Let's take... Let's take one in Infuser. And then one in Mystic. I think. So when we're going we're gonna to be modifying some crystals. And we have one left. <laughs> this is big boy choices here because these take like omega pogs to reset i think it takes three omega pogs to reset it so they ain't nothing that we're going to be resetting anytime soon of course we will get uh what three more before at level 50 so I mean, yeah, we'll still we'll get we'll get several more that we could play with. <clears throat> One left. Should we take experienced five hundred percent XP increase? That all us level up. I don't think I'm too worried about bartering. Uh. We're not even there with Angel, so we can't even unlock that. Artisan Station to not consume crafting potential. This is not, not a bad one, either. I think we go experienced right now. <coughs> Done. Okay. Skill points. We got five left. <laughs> um... Let's see, do we want to take an armor? We could just, we, I just, I don't know if I have enough mana right now to actually handle it. Um, we'll upgrade Nova to three. Um, let's see. go with a smite build taunt build um throw another one in that just to get that down to a hundred seconds Could go totem. If we want. And then our main attack abilities will be Nova, Javelin, and our Sword. Okay. And this would give us so if we went hatred, that would increase the percentage of our damage. To all mobs within a range. Uh, let's see, spirit regenerates your mana, and then wrath increases your damage. Okay. And then this one is just a straight heal. Um, let's see. Let's go one more Nova. I want to start using Nova a lot. <coughs> Uh, we need to do Let's do another one in dash, another one in hunter for now. And this is what we'll go with to start off with. Okay. So we need to do some key binds. Controls, key binds. All right, so we need dash. Dash, I have set on R. Cool. 
All right, so the key is R. What else is on R? Range, overlay, okay. Uh, show recipe, don't care about that. And then our dash ability. Okay, cool. Um, let's see, we need a javelin, right? A javelin, what do we want javelin to be? I think I'm gonna go with V on javelins. So we need to see what was key binded to V. Cycle mode, pick up, let's see, head, switch mode, okay, open ping. Okay, cool. Done with that one. And then we had Nova, right? Nova, not Nova, um, what's it called? Was it not Nova? Um, what is it? What 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 is what's it called? It's called Nova. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Ah, there it is. Nova to Z. Oh, I probably had the keys button. I already had the keys button on. All right, so what's on Z? Uh, hot bar swap. Nope. Enlarge mini map. Don't care about that. Okay. Um, let's see. Let's see. Uh, heal. Right. We got. We haven't done heal. Heal is my F button. All right, what is on F? Uh, swapping offhand, nope. Cool. Done. Done. Okay. So we have Nova. Yeah. Oh, Vein Miner. We need Vein Miner. Uh, we need. Vein miner set to C. No. What is on C button? Uh, nope. No. 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 Cool. Done with that. Okay. All right. Let's see. We have Nova, Vein Miner. All right. Ghost Watt. Okay. We didn't do anything there or there. Heal is F. Javelins is on V. Hunter. We forgot Hunter. Hunter, I do X. X marks the spot, right? X marks the spot. So what's on X? Um, nothing. Cool. Back to game. Good, good, good. All right. We have our crystal. Let's see, we'll put this back. Do that. Let's see, our quest book can go there. Let's see, that can go there. Um, let's see, we need some blocks. Alright, throw those there for now. Grab our pouches. We 
should have our, yes, it is empty, 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 beautiful, bam, oh, I should have did an elixir, I forgot to do that, all right, that's okay, so that's okay, because that was our bounty, all right, nice, ooh, I might want to change that, what is, E is inventory, <clears throat> I think it'd be easier to hit. I'm gonna have to get used to dash heal. Q is drop. Hmm. I'm gonna have to learn how to be a gamer. <laughs> So I learned how to be a gamer again. <clears throat> C was vein miner. It might end up going on like caps lock. Maybe. Uh, bounty. Uh, we did not set a keybind for. Say bounty. Set it to B. For bounty. What is set to B? Um, mode switch. Open backpack, gotcha. Active bounty. Get waypoint. Cool. Alright. So elixir. So let's activate a second bounty. Kill strays. Kill skellies. That's a lot of Larry more. Some painite. can collect soul shards. Cool. Alright. Let's get into a bowl. Magnus at 73%. I have completed a quest. Thank you. It is... It is not that impossible. It is lucky and coin stacks as well. There's also a cave theme. Okay. Let's see. Let's see what we got here. Purple is uh, Vault Dwellers, right? I believe that is correct. We are going south. Alright, let's go upstairs. So we need four eight. Oh man, look at these guys. So good, so good. Okay. So we do need some mining speed. Automatic, the affinities automatically, so that does work. And look at these mobs, look at these new mobs. <laughs> You're dead. Nice. Nice. Oh, so it's automatic. Okay, that's right. This this one doesn't have uh, this one doesn't have gilded on it. Mystery A. Cool. 
purple mob essence. Thank you, thank you. So yeah, I don't I don't mind the uh, the vault dwell dweller traps in this one. Hello, hello, mobs. These are the trash mobs for this theme, I believe. Oh. So they're 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 pretty easy. Uh, Yep, so basically this is, so we need uh, Gilded Affinity on our next tool. Red scroll, okay. There we go, there's a mob trap. I don't completely mind it, because we need a purple mob essence. There we go, we got one there. Beautiful. So I don't mind it completely. like the pickup notifier is working really well right off hand which is what I like to see All right. excellent and as I said like I'm not the fastest looter in the world and all this kind of stuff and I don't care it's it is what it is <laughs> Yeah, so we do, I'd say we put a little bit of mining speed on here just so we can mine the uh, wooden chest faster. We need to put Gilded Affinity on our next one as well. Um, excellent. We got one. Nice. And you find the rib cages in the vault stone. Let's see. Larry Moore. Okay. Oh, there is a uh, there's a dungeon here. You can hear the illagers. Friend, update nine, is buddy. Update nine is here. You ready for it? <laughs> it's living. It is a living. And we want to get the altars or possibly a. Um... Hi guys. Uh, it is a butthole dungeon. It looks like. How we doing? How we doing? Um, let's see. We got 
got six purple. We have a rib cage. We have zero jars. Perfect. There is no table. Am I playing music? Uh, I'm just playing the regular Minecraft music is playing uh, right now. If that's what you're asking. It's very loud. Okay. Okay. Very loud. Okay. I, I it, it completely reset the settings. Uh, yeah. Okay. So yeah, I, I didn't lower. It. it probably needs to be down. Probably needs to be down there. We'll see if that's better. How's that? Is that a lot better? Okay. Okay. That should have dropped it. I did not completely reset my settings once it. Uh, because we just, uh, okay, that's a bit better. Can you hear you? Good, good. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Uh, we just literally went through doing, resetting some of the settings for key binds and everything. So we just finished that up. All right. So these are the tank mobs. Okay. <laughs> he burped. Oh, that's right. The tank mobs, uh, those, these ones, they burp and they heal. Uh, but yeah, I'll have to get my settings back to where they were at um, completely. I don't, I don't remember what we had them at before update nine, but we'll, uh, we'll continue to work on them and get uh, and get the settings all back to where they were. I'll get with uh, I'll get with my one of my other moderators, Flatty. Flatty helped me out a lot getting stuff adjusted. But yeah, if, as long as you guys can hear me, that is the main thing. Hopefully, you can hear me over the music. Level 15 already in your new world. Uh, did you watch um, Iskul's? Um, Did you watch Iskul's uh, new YouTube video? I think he got up to level three or four or something, five. I don't know. Within that first video, it was about it was about an hour long. What do we got? What do we got? Fifteen minutes. Okay. <clears throat> Say coin piles. Hopefully we'll get the uh, we'll get everything in the back mobs right here. Uh, no, it was actually uh, so he's doing a completely new introduction, I guess, series. I, I see you, Skelly. Uh, do, new kind of new introduction for uh, Vault Hunters. The um, the Sky Vault series will come out. Probably later this year, he said, sometime in the fall. Uh, but yeah, it's uh, he's kind of going through and showing people how to play Vault Hunters. So he completely restarted his YouTube Vault Hunters series. Excellent. mobs I think I like the scaling I like the scaling so far I mean the, the little zombies are supposed to die quick that's what they're supposed to do um, these are the tank mobs okay. nice. I gotta get used to um, Gotta get used to my new key binds. I think I might move Javelin to something else. I don't think I have been. <laughs> been studying, eating, vaulting, and sleeping. Nice. Hey, that's okay. 
I imagine uh, then you're uh, probably getting ready to finish up your semester then. There's our fast mobs. We missed our healing cloud. Okay, that wasn't too terrible. There's another trash mob. Not sure where he came from. Let's, let's see, this is an assassin spawn. Skelly, right? Alright, so we got 12 minutes. Oh, we haven't seen an ornate yet. <clears throat> haven't seen an ornate yet. I guess we just keep running straight. Handed in one module last Thursday and on track for finishing early on the last module, which is due this. Okay, cool. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Yep, my uh, my oldest son is set to graduate from high school here at the end of the month. And then my other two are, they're finishing up their semester. They're both... Uh, one of them is also, an, he's a freshman in high school, and then I have an eighth grader in middle school. They are finishing up. They should finish up in a couple weeks. And then a little bit of summer vacation. That's wooden, wooden. There's coin piles over there, wooden. All right, we got to find some more naders. But yeah, oldest getting ready, set to graduate, which is nice. Downstairs, what do we got? Wooden, wooden. There's some more nades. There's some more nades. I like, I do like the, um, the fizzle spawners. It's nice. Fizzle spawning is nice. We might need to look into, uh, there's a sack. Oh, baby. Hello. We might need to look at uh, getting a new. So I'm not sure. Um, I do. I do remember Isco saying might need to do a new sword because they might not scale correctly. So this might. This sword might be doing too much damage. So if, I mean, because this is an older sword. So I mean, if that's the case, that's fine. We'll just we'll make ourselves a new sword. Yeah, fizzles are so nice. Um, okay. How much time we got? We got 10 minutes here. Assassin spawner. Okay, that's what this one's called. They hurt. They hurt a little. So that's gilded. I hear somebody. It's like, I hear you walking. All right, so yeah, we need yeah we need to make a new tool with Gilded Affinity. I do like that you can still break them like this though, so it'll just be faster. All right, let's see. Oh, there's living there. We don't need living, but I do need living because. Okay, cool. Man, this little spawner is so nice. So nice just to say hi. Boop. Nice. Is 
said plurrup. Man, I, I like the change. I like that change. It's so nice. Uh, wooden. We'll move on. We need some ornators. So we need the ornators. Uh, yeah, for the wooden chest, definitely need to do some mining speed. I have zero, I believe, right? Yeah, I have zero mining speed on this. This was the backup one I made the other the other day because our other one broke <laughs> before update now was released. So let's see. Ornate, what do we got? Do we have, we have one jar. We have the purple mob. That's okay. Say plop plop plop. Yeah, I think first off, I think we need to change the javelin. I definitely need to change javelin. Um. I just need to get used to, um, so if we're going to go with a Nova build, I just, I just got to get used to using Nova, um, got to, got to use javelins. So Nova Jeff. But yeah, I like the, I like the trash mobs. I like uh, like the fact that I, I agree. I feel powerful from what the school was saying. I like it. I do like that aspect. There's another empty jar. Haven't spec javelins. We got five minutes. <clears throat> Need to get some more treasure keys fragments so we can make ourselves some treasure keys as well open up a treasure room
Let's probably head home. Say, so let's probably head home. Minute twenty. I think taking dash was important there. Just being able to traverse across the uh, pits and stuff, I think is smart. Just be able to dash right across the room. Not bad. Say not bad, not bad. But yeah, I think we did okay for our first update nine vault. Thank you, thank you. 52, 152 coin piles. We did do a lot of coin piles. 110. So we did break 100, which is good. 110 chests. So yeah, we got past the 100 mark, which is good. 171 mobs unalived. Okay. Cool. Now, this will be the real tell here. How many? Where did all our soul shards go? Oh, I bet you they went into one of our pouches, didn't they? 328. I hate that. I'm going to have to put the soul shard there and then the pouches, I think. Grr. All right, empty flask, some inscription pieces. Um, that's a pretty good jewel. That's a perfect jewel. Size 17 with four, 5.6 mining speed. That is a really good jewel. So I plop those in there. That's that's a really, really good jewel. Man, look at that thing. Yeah, I mean, almost perfect rolled on the mining speed. I mean, it's mid-tier extra durability. I say we just might put that on our uh, I, I mean I don't I'm not a big fan of the pulverizing uh, 200 carboon nice some bounty pearls got ourselves a mod box I liked it. That felt pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good.
pretty good. Let's see, cobblestone. We got some tomatoes, some relic packs. We need to work on our relics too. Some burger pieces. Unfortunately, we're not going to be able to do our full length stream that we wanted to do today. And I woke up late too, so. <laughs> Say, I just wanted to sleep this morning. But we will do a, a nice big stream later this week at some point. <coughs> And we'll just we'll just play. We'll say we'll just play all day. I'm gonna take a day off of work and just play. So we got three pieces in there. Lucky modifier coming into play. I yeah, see that's a garbage one and that's a pulverizing garbage one <laughs> Sleep is better sometimes <laughs> Yeah, I just I couldn't get out of bed this morning. I was like my alarm went off and I was like uh, Now nah, I'll play later. I was like no, nah, I'll play later Because today is my our late day for work. We don't go until later uh, 32 smelting I was like, I can, I can just do like a normal like two hour, two and a half hour stream and I'll be okay. All right. <clears throat> that is a great tool. Okay, so. That one we are going to consider. <laughs> yeah, playing games, always better. All right, so. We do have some picking. Wouldn't mind throwing some trap disarm on it. So anytime we hit the chests. Oh gosh. Yeah, this thing. Biggest game changer in Minecraft right there. All right, an ornate. There's a perfect coin one. Um, ba -ba -ba. Durability, durability. A wooden, that's got a wooden on it already if we decide to definitely use it. So we need living. <laughs> That one's living and hammer size and coin. Eh. That's not terrible. For 28, we could use that one. Because that's less than 10 for each one. And that'll also give us a uh, 3x3 three three for hammering just inside the vaults automatically. So that one, I think... We use that, and then we use some of our other ones. So we need a gilded one, right? It's like, I thought I had a gilded one. There's a perfect size mining speed. We'll throw that on there. Smelting trap disarm wooden. See, I don't know. This one is, and this one's so good. The only problem is the pulverizing. Gilded, 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 gilded. Shoveling. Do we want shoveling on... See, I don't know if we want shovel. We want axing for sure. There's a perfect axing jewel. That's wooden. An item quantity. That's wooden and... Wooden, that's just straight wooden. Wooden pulverizing. Let's see. 
So these two are up for debate. Which one do we use? <coughs> There's our gilded one. All right, so we have coin living, ornate, axing, gilded. Perfect. Okay. Give us a little bit extra reach. Hmm. For sure, soul bound. Ah, uh, four percent chance trapped. Disarm, soul bound. I think we add that one to it. We'll add that one to it, I guess. Uh, let's see. Smelting, we'll save that one. 24 size. 19% track disarm. 22, 22. There's a perfect one for 11%. And then we can add some mining speed to it. That's a living and mining speed one. That's not bad. That's not a bad one. And we have our copious. All right, let's see what we get with these offhand, and then we can add some more. So we need to make a new tool. Make the Volterite pickaxe. So we need Volterite ingots. Driftwood, bronze, wu to die, mass, plutonic mass. Wu tonic mass. So it needed three wu tonic mass. Say Volta right ingots right where is the vault right ingots there it is vault right ingots we need what nine of them Okay, driftwood, right? Driftwood, we have bronze. We need 12 vault writing it's okay. Twelve. <clears throat> we need to smelt down some more chromatic. Alright, so we can make our first vault right pick. Because we're gonna go pick, right? Because yeah, we got axing, shoveling, yep. Okay. Because that, then we have the coin affinity living one. Bam. How do we do it over here? Oh. So I was trying to grow poppies. I can't grow poppies in there. Um, I was like, why is that not growing? Say it's not growing. So that's been a lot of wasted time with that one. There we go. Yeah, okay, cool. So a lot of wasted time on that one. All 
All right, got our pouches down. So bloop, 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 bloop. Voltarite. So nine. Uh, so get us to 15, 20, 23. Okay. All right. So. Do we like this one? This will give us some hammering size on it for sure. Do we like it? Do we like it? It gives us living coin affinity as well. Or we need to ornate. That'll give us axing, mining speed, trap disarm. Okay. That gives us the... W See, I just, I'm not sure about the pulverizing on it. I'm still not sure about the pulverizing. What is pulver pulverizing does what like with like cobble like it makes stuff into makes stone into cobblestone right so if we mine let's just say we mine stone stone that's smooth regular stone if we crush it. Uh, that. Yeah, 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 yeah. It, I know that it, it sets it back. I'm just wondering what we get from like cobblestone. Is, isn't cobblestone drop gravel? I'm just trying to figure out what um, smelting igneous extruders. I'm just trying to figure out what uh, should we put pulverizing on it? Should we put pulverizing on it or not? This is a good living jewel too. Living plus mining speed. We might do this one instead of this one and not go with the hammer size and save the hammer size for something else. So that means we need, we just need coin affinity. We had a perfect coin one, didn't we? Yeah, there it is. So we go with that one. Just get some extra mining speed on it. This is the only one that I'm not sure about. I like the mining speed on it. This one, yeah. We'll try it. It's fine. We'll try it. We'll try it. It's this is not going to be our end all pickaxe either. Okay. Let's see where this gets us to. We need saw the big boy on there first. Paxel. It becomes axing, shoveling, mining speed, trap disarm. Okay. We want the coin on there. We want that definitely. We want gilded. Um, we want the wooden. We want the living. Right. So that gives us 95 left. And we are at plus 14 extra mining speed. It does everything. There's some extra dura on it. All right, so we'll do that. That gets us a 20%, so every any fifth, right? Fifth trapped 
chest would be disarmed. Okay. That gives us the 85. All right, that one's not great. Um, so that'll get us the 20 plus mining speed. Yep, 21. Okay. That gets us 27 with 61 left. Okay, let's take a look. We could throw the legendary trap disarm chance on there. 19%. Uh, we'll save that one, I guess. Um, let's see. Yep, save that one. Soulbound trap disarm. That one's smelting trap disarm. Soulbound. Trap disarm 10% for 24. Twenty-four, let's see, what is that? That's sixty, it's that's seventy-one. We don't have enough room on it to put both of them, do we? 70, so yeah, we're 10 short. Okay. Um, let's see. 10% for 24. So that's 30%. Trap disarm, there's 37 left on it. Um, I, I'm good with that. Let's do... Let's see what we get. Let's see what we got. What else we got? 17 size, 23, so that's 40. What do we have left on it? 37. Okay. <coughs> That's the one we should have put on there. Throw some more durability on it. It's 26, 26. So that's the best 26 one we have for durability. Okay. So that'll leave us 11. <laughs> So the extra 4%. So that's 37 between the two of those. Sure, why not? Throw some extra durability on it. A little bit extra. Trap disarm. Cool. All right. So then we need... How are we going to enchant this thing? I mean, I don't know. How, golly, this is this is gonna be tough, guys. I don't know how to enchant this. Oh wait, I have this thing. That's right. Um, let's see. Let's see. Right. That's right. Ah, the vault enchanter. Oh my goodness. <laughs> uh, yeah. Five emeralds for efficiency five plus one. Yeah. We'll do that. We'll do silk touch on her. And I'm breaking. Look at that. Look at that, so easy. So easy. Done. Have ourselves a Paxel with, was that 36 mining speed? We'll see how well it does. So this is an old one now, we can throw it in there. Uh, we'll see. We completed a quest, didn't we? Complete. <clears throat> what did we get? We got bronze. 32 bronze. Chromatic.
Beautiful. Start spelt some of those back up. However, we do need to do some chest looting. We, we're going to make ourselves a copious one here just for mining jewels. So we'll do that one at some point. We do probably want to make that one soon. All right, what is next? Bounties. Complete a bounty. Okay. All right, so we still have two active. Gather elixir. Okay, so we'll do a sage. Right? Sage. So we'll put that here. Oh, we need apples. Okay. I don't know if we have any apples. Copper flesh. This one is going to be difficult. Let's see, apples, 44, not enough. We're halfway there though. <laughs> All right, I'll be right back. <clears throat> Gotta go get something to drink. Already, already, already. <clears throat> I'll say we're back, we're back. Uh, I'll say the wife did a little bit of shopping yesterday, got me some new K pods. So we're, I'm trying the Columbia Supremo from Sam's Club.
Uh, what did it say? Copper? Five. And what's a deep slate? How much deep slate do we have? Okay. So our shortfall is apples. <clears throat> I don't have a farmer villager either. Apples, apples, apples. Hmm. That's cool. I, I can get them from raw living chests from Sky Vaults. That's cool. Botania. Can't do them with botany pots, apparently. <laughs> Alright, so we would... We need 44 apples. My goodness. That is a mean, mean... One. I don't know if we're going to be able to get there today. <laughs> Uh, what are you gonna do? Apples. 88 apples. Ah. This makes me rethink production. <clears throat> do we go easy villagers? Instead of Kajerium. Ugh, 44 more apples. Um, <clears throat> let's see. Composter. Family member. I gotta get rid of these ones. These ones are gonna cause too much lag because I didn't break their work workstation. Let's try him. bad for using my uh, <coughs> my brand new one here but it is what it is okay um, we throw that there composter there cool he wants wheat I should have grabbed my uh should have grabbed my emeralds and stuff. Uh, <clears throat> say emerald. So I grab some of those. Um, sure. We'll make him a potato. <coughs> So we'll make him a potato farmer, whatever. Hello.
What else? What else? You are a potato and carrot guy, so you're perfect. <coughs> Upgrade you. I probably should have grabbed. Probably should have grabbed one of my pickaxes. <coughs> probably should have grabbed one of my pickaxes. What not? Right there. Like do that. Should have done that. Uh, let's see, carrots. Sure, we're producing carrots. Do some carrot trading as well. This should be the quickest way to get to the apples, I think. Yeah, I just I just saw Isco went live. I just saw that. So, hey, it's all good, man. If you want to watch Isco, go right ahead. Take some cookies, I guess. I don't know. Upgrade. And talking to my friends on the Discord, nice. No apples. Ugh. Come on, man. Say, come on, man. Uh, is what is app? Is it like the third tier one? Ugh. He's not gonna do it for us, I don't think. Well, at least we have one farmer. Man, that's that's rough. Say that's rough. That's rough. I was hoping to get the seal done before we had to go, but that's not going to be the case. I'm going to have to work on a couple more villagers off camera. That's unfortunate. Uh, soul shards. All right. Only 500. All right. Can I pick these up? Or do I have to go like this? I have to go like this. All right. Yeah, that's unfortunate. That is unfortunate. I'll put that there, because that way, or maybe, so if we go that there, this there, put our soul pouch right there, have our extras, and we can have our pouches up here. Almost expert for, see, I could have, because he is an expert. Let's take a look. Let's take a look again. I like the new healing cloud effect. Okay. 
So you are expert. Alright. We'll buy some cakes. No, yeah, he's master now. Yeah, so this one just didn't do it for us. Because I think master's uh, golden carrots, right? That's the last one. So we'll just we'll have to get a new guy. We'll have to do a, another one, which is fine, because we could go um, we can go beetroot, the trade beetroot as well. Um, so if he does beetroot and apples, that'd be fine, you know, or whatnot. We can buy some apples off of him. All right, good, good, good. Yeah, I'm going to have to do some grinding for some apples. Let's see. <clears throat> these are oak trees, right? I think. Are these oak trees? So oak trees give apples as well. That's our ravine, I think. What are we used for mining? We do need to make a proper... Um, yeah, the grind is real. <coughs> I don't know, yeah, I mean, this 44 apples, this, this makes me want to go easy villagers next. Say, my hunter is caps. Yeah, I'm actually, I'm thinking, uh, I'm, I'm thinking, uh, I'm thinking going caps lock for, I don't mind my hunter being on X. But yeah, I'm thinking caps lock for javelins. Let's see, we got dash. E, f I, I could change out inventory E. I can change it to something else if I really wanted to. To kind of make Nova. So do Nova somewhere else instead of trying to do Z. I don't know. Get my hotkeys fixed. But man, that this this is me. That frustrates me. Hmm. 564 soul shards. Oh, it already reset. <laughs> Say we missed it. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. So we're not going to get to a thousand anytime soon. Okay. Cool, cool. Alrighty, alrighty. Well, Iskol is live. I know he's live. <laughs> There's Iskol in the background. <laughs> Alright. Good deal. Alright, well, I gotta get ready and go to work and get some stuff done this morning. Probably cook some breakfast. My wife just got home. She had to go and run and do a early morning meeting before she actually goes into work. It was an off-site meeting, so she had to do that. And so she just got back. That was who I was talking to a minute ago. All right, yeah, we got a gr we got a grind for the apples. Ash, you enjoy watching Iskol and whatnot. Well, yeah, guys, I do appreciate you coming out to the stream. We're going to work a little bit more on... Uh, grinding this out but i do appreciate it you guys have a great day um yeah enjoy vault hunters update nine man it's here we'll see you guys bye